Good morning, everybody. It's Deborah from the Bath and Body Bistro, and I'm sitting here this morning, and I've gotten so addicted to this YouTube thing that all I want to do now is make videos. Thank you, Kim. Anyway, so I'm sitting here this morning, a little chilly in our store, and waiting for them to hook up our um, heater. So I have my coffee, my big, huge bubba keg. Well, it's about four or five cups of coffee. Um, yeah, I like coffee. Anyway, I wanted to share with um, you guys what my friend, I'm going to call her the Soap Fairy, because she came in at the beginning of the week, Miss Kim, you guys all know her, um, and she brought me these molds. Look how cute. It's perfect because she kind of turned me on to this oven process soap making. Cold process, oven process. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's perfect if you sell your products and you have a store and you got to get that soap out. Because I got a lot of uh, special orders people want me to do. And and it's great that you don't have to wait that six to or four to six weeks, six to eight weeks for the curing, whatever um, recipe you're using. Anyway... Not only did she bring me one in, or two, she brought me a whole box full. I mean, the soap fairy is awesome. Look at this. Get that paper out of the way. Look at this. I think there was 12 or 13 in here. And perfect, perfect, perfect size because um, at my store I don't have an oven. All I have is this toaster oven. So, the molds fit perfectly in there. It holds up to three pounds of soap, which is pretty much what I do because I like to work in small batches. I just have more control over it. Um, so, I guess this is kind of a haul for Nature's Art and the Soap Fairy, Miss Kim. She does rock, I tell you. I haven't known her very long, but I feel like I've known her forever. Um, anyway, so I just wanted to share that with you and thank you, all you guys, uh, for checking out my videos and making comments on them. I really appreciate it. And I will probably talk to you later. Um, blessings. Bye.